Welcome to Rebel DeFi, where I share videos that are categorically not financial advice, simply a record of my journey towards financial freedom using decentralized finance on the Terra ecosystem. As I record this video today, we've got Bitcoin pushing 49,000 and the Terra Luna token pushing $36. What I'm going to look at today is how I would start investing on Terra if I was starting again just now. I'm going to look at how I would set up the Terra Station Chrome extension as well as the desktop application. I'm going to investigate swapping and staking using the Terra Station application as well as depositing UST, the stablecoin on the Terra ecosystem, into the Anchor protocol. So I'm doing everything in the Google Chrome web browser. This is the Terra.money website, and we can get to that from CoinGecko. Let me just click on the Terra token, the Luna token. And it shows us their website there is Terra.money. So this is where I can download the application and the web extension that I need. So first off, I'm going to download the Chrome extension and just add this to my browser. So I've now got the Chrome extension pinned and I need to create a new wallet. So I'm going to choose this option and it's given me this massive seed phrase, and this is a really important part in DeFi. I'm basically becoming my own bank, so this is the key to the bank vault. So I need to be super careful with what I do with this seed phrase. Definitely don't share it anywhere online. I don't keep mine on my computer anywhere. I'm not necessarily sure if this is the best option, but what I do is I write this down and I put half of my seed phrase in one location, half of my seed phrase in another location to try and keep it as secure as possible. So I just set up a new wallet in the Chrome extension and I was careful to write down my seed phrase accurately. Um, I'm now over in the Terra Station desktop application which I downloaded from the Terra.money website. I'm on Mac so I just downloaded this version. It installs just like standard Mac applications and this is what I'm presented with. So what I need, now need to do is also get this wallet logged in to the one, the same one that I just created using the Chrome extension. So I don't want to create a new wallet this time, I want to go to the recover existing wallet and I enter in my wallet name, my password and then I have to put in the whole seed phrase to prove that I am the actual custodian of this wallet and then get this one logged in. I'm now in my Terra Station desktop application just on the dashboard page and it's got loads of information about Luna and the ecosystem. What I'm going to do now is take a look in my wallet Obviously, when it's first set up, it has nothing. But I've transferred over about $1,000 worth of Luna into this wallet. And if I had $1,000 worth of Luna in my wallet, I think this is what I might do to begin with. Now, there's stuff I can do in the Terra Station desktop application that I can't do from the Chrome extension. And one of those things is staking. So what I'm going to do is take about half of my Luna and stake it with one of the validators which helps to secure the network and also gets me staking rewards. And with the upcoming Columbus 5 upgrade, there is rumoured to be a lot of staking rewards coming out. So I think it could be quite profitable to do a little bit of staking as well as play my part in securing the network. 
Um, I've done a little bit of research. I've decided that I want to go with a smaller validator to keep it a little bit more decentralized. And the one I fancy going for is, I'm just going to reorder the list. This one here, Talus Protocol. So I'm going to click here. I am going to delegate about half my Luna to Talus Protocol. So I'm going to go for 15 Luna. So that's about $500 at current prices. My fee is fairly small. So that is 15 Luna delegated to Talus Protocol. So I've now got 15 or so left in the staking section. I can click on my delegations and see that I've got 15 delegated there. I'm just going to have a quick look at where I am. So I've set up both the Chrome extension and the desktop application. I have staked some Luna using the desktop application. The second thing I want to do now is get some of the UST stable coins. So I can do a swap in this section. And I'm going to swap Luna for UST. And I'm going to swap everything I've got. So I'll just click Next. Again, pay, pay my fee in Luna. And transactions are usually fairly quick. Done. So let's have a look in my wallet, see what I've got now. I still have a fraction of Luna left and 550 UST. Right, so I'm now going to have a look at my third thing that I wanted to do, which is stake some of my UST into Anchor Protocol. So if I go back here and have a look for the Anchor token, which is ANC. And their official website, anchorprotocol.com. And what Anchor essentially is, is a, what tells us here, better savings. I think it's an awesome place for me to earn serious interest much, much better than any bank. I'm going to accept notifications. So this is the updated version of the Anchor Protocol website. I need to connect my wallet, which is my web extension version. So I'm going to click this. Choose the TerraStation extension. Do I want to allow Anchor Protocol to access my wallet? I do because I want to interact with this website. So I'm now connected. It shows me my balance there, which is exactly the same as I've got in my TerraStation desktop app. So that's looking all good. There's various things I can do on Anchor, but the one I want to do today is go to the Earn tab. And when I first started getting into DeFi, I was absolutely just blown away. And in fact, I still am blown away by these interest rates we get it just doesn't seem possible but it completely is 100 percent possible and that's why i love decentralized finance on the terra ecosystem so what i'm going to do is deposit some of my stable coins into the anchor earn section i'm going to put in 500 leaving myself with a decent amount that i can use for transaction fees and see, it's not completely free to put this money in. A couple of dollars. But I like round numbers, so that's why I'm starting with 500. And again, putting the password in.
done. So I love this section down here. This is showing me that if I do nothing else in 52 weeks, I will have an extra $97 in my account. I don't have to do anything to claim these dollars. They're just auto compounded every day. So you can see that I'm earning 26 cents every day and that will just increase over time. So just to look back at what I said I was gonna address in this video, I have set up both the TerraStation Chrome extension and desktop application. I have staked and swapped using the desktop application, and I've also deposited some UST into Anchor Protocol. One of the reasons I made this video was a friend has been asking me a few questions about what I'm up to using DeFi and he just wanted to find out a little bit more. The next thing I'm going to be addressing is how I get money from GBP pounds into the Terra ecosystem. So if you're interested in following my journey, feel free to subscribe or come back and check out future videos. Thank you.